Well, hello, everybody. No, I look tired as crap in this video. Well, here's my story. I started trucking back in June. I went to school. At the time, I was happily married to my wife. And as I was going to school, I was going to go into a, as I was going to the trekking school. I start yelling at her, fighting with her all the time, because I'm diagnosed with bipolar, and it just got worse and worse and worse. It's gotten to the point where we fight almost all the time, and I, I just don't know what to do. I'm just, I just want people to understand that just don't take it out on your wife or girlfriends. They're the innocent people. Don't make, don't make this, don't make the same mistake I've made. Because I'm going to be 43 this year. I'm going to be alone. I'm overweight. So, we you trying to, me, I love my, I love my wife to death. I just don't know what the future is going to hold. We're having our problems. We said we're going to work on them. Hopefully, we're able to. Just, just when you're having a bad day, when you're when you're out there, just don't take it out on your loved ones. They didn't do nothing wrong to be deserve this. I just needed somebody to talk to. This is about the only way I was able to talk to somebody. I just, I will, me and her will get through this. But just, when you're having a bad day, just keep it to yourself. They're back home trying to support you. You're trying to support them. Just take it one day at a time. You need, you need to respect people because that's my biggest problem. I didn't respect her. Because every time she was going out, I kept calling her, calling her, and calling her, blowing up her phone. That didn't give her space. They need their space. Because I also kept, every time she asked me to not call her for a while, I, I just kept on calling. I didn't listen to her at all. Didn't respect her. I was only thinking about me and not her feelings. And that's not the way to do it. So I'm, 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 with, I'm working on my problems. I'm sure me and her will get through this. Well, talk to y'all later. Bye.